Don't ask the question. I'm in tears right now. I'm in tears. Boss, good afternoon. Sorry to disturb you. I know you're busy. I'm on live. I want to ask you one question, boss. One question. Sorry to bother you. 2023, you guys give critics five million dollars. Is this real or is it a prank, boss? No disrespect. No. Oh, the man come here and said, Pops, I need five million dollars to, to go and um settle with his family. You know? Oh, yeah. We gave him the $5 million. Cash, cash money. $5 million cash. Oh my God. Boss, I'll tell you the fame. I'll tell you how to give tomorrow the deadline. He got rid of them two car, the bike. I'll give you the deadline tomorrow, boss. You hear me? Tomorrow. Okay, boss. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, boss. That's it. I want the guy in the police force to know. Tomorrow at 12 o'clock. Hi, Doggy Yano. For the face and the name. I will be fucking seasoned guy. He's got the two vehicles and the fucking bike. And then I'm gonna go back with the iMac and I'm gonna pull up the fucking studio. Compliments of me. This is not a joke. I take all responsible. I take all responsible. 12 Somebody die on Critics work site. A crane operator. Critics collect five million dollars from Mohammed. And give his family 460 fucking thousand. Is that right? Where the fuck is critics? Why I see. Well, you still didn't get your ticket? This flight takes off every single day. Tap that subscription button. Thanks. Very emotional today in the boardroom of Mohammed's Enterprise when we meet with the family and relatives of now dead Mr. Sean Anthony Joseph, father four of number 76 Village Court in Barbie, who died as a result of an industrial accident while working as a crane operator for Tipool Group. Mr. Joseph at the time was employed by Tipool Group Construction Company, the company which is owned and managed by Manalki Rodriguez popular known as Guyanese Critics and was contracted to construct a war for Mohammed's enterprise. During the encounter with the family, Mr. Mohammed learned that all critics did for the family was to extend his sympathy, give them a more of 460,000 and attended the funeral. Mr. Nazar Mohammed was shocked when he heard this news and felt compelled intervene. It is worthy to know that on October 7th, 2023, critics visited his office at Lombard Street and collected five million under pretext of settling with the family of Mr. Joseph. Oh my fucking God. Critics is a fucking thief. God, he thief in Mother Scott now. You see, right? How are you? I see. Somebody die on Critics work site. A crane operator. Critics collect five million dollars from Mohammed. And give his family 460 fucking thousand. Is that right? Where the fuck is Critics? I want you to see. Y'all fucking asshole. Y'all assholes what fall a fucking teeth in Critics. This is where it's called a fucking teeth. This is where it's called a fucking thief. I tell y'all. He big gold, he bought a scud. Critics robbed the fucking dead. Even the fucking dead, he robbed. Oh my God. Wow. 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 Look at this here. Let's read. Let's read. October 7, 2023, critics visited his office at Lombard Street. He visited it, I get time, I get recorded, and collect five million under the pretext of settling with the family of Mr. Joseph, but this never happened. Upon learning of the development, Mr. Mohammed said, this is unbelievable, I cannot understand that human beings could be so cruel. Look at this family, the main breadwinner is gone. Look at these children. Who will nurture and take care of them? My God. Wow. I got I got I got interview this family. I gotta interview. I gotta interview this family. I gotta call this family. 
ladies and gentlemen, breaking news. I'm going to interview a dead family. Look, look here. Look, look, look here. This is the family. Look here. Mr. Mohammed, look. Family. The boss has the Mohammed. Father, look. Look. The man, children, look at this. This is when the man died. My condolence to his family, right? Look. Wow. You see? This is what bosses do. This is what real bosses do. This is the definition of a fucking boss. Not a boss to be. Look. My wife is crying. Crying. Wow. You see? Look, my boss. My boss is vexed. He's a fucking thief. He had. He had a thief around him. Wow. Look at this. Oh, why you attack the fucking low life fucking thief mother scunt? You attack critics. Tag him mother scunt right now. Tag him fucking friends. You tag him right now. We're going to get breaking news. We're going to get fucking breaking news. I'm going to give it to you today. Watch. I'm going to give it to you today, mother scunt. I'm going to give it to you today. I'm going to give it to him today. I'm going to give it to fucking you today. I'm going to give it to you today. I'm going to give it to him today. This is real. He's a fucking thief. You collect five million dollars from Mohammed, from Mohammed, to give to the family that died under your working. You get him four hundred and sixty thousand dollars. Are you fucking kidding me? I tell you, all he's a fucking thief. He's a low life fucking thief, mother scunt. Where is Melly Mel? Where's Odessa Primos? Y'all tag them for me. Tag them. Tag them. February going out with a bang. We going out with a fucking bang. Look at this. Look at this. The family is grieving. The family is grieving. Look at this. The man died. Right? This is how the man died. Right, the family is grieving. The family is grieving. Grieving. You see? The family is grieving. Look. Critics. Look, look the date. Look. Look the date. October 7, 2023. Visited the office at Lombard Street and collected $5 million. $5 million. 460 gifts to the family. You see, fucking wicked. Yo, what are we done with fucking critics? Y'all more scunting me when I done with fucking critics. I'm going to ask a question. I'm in tears right now. I'm in tears. Boss, good afternoon. Sorry to disturb you. I know you're busy. I'm on live. I want to ask you one question, boss. One question. Sorry to bother you. 2023, wow. you guys give critics $5 million. Is this real or is it a prank, boss? No disrespect. No. no the man come here and said, Pops, I need $5 million to, to go and um, settle with his family. You know? Yeah. We gave him the five million dollars. Cash, he cash money. Nothing. Five million dollar cash. Oh my god. <laughs> Boss. I'm tired of him. I tell you how to give tomorrow the deadline. He got rid of them two car the bike. I give you the deadline tomorrow, boss. Hear me? Yeah, tomorrow. You okay, boss. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, boss. That's it. Yeah, pack the fucking stinking low life. He have two car for me. The boss take away one daddy. And a fucking bike. And get in the studio. Comment section. I'm going to share it with you guys. I'm going to share it with you guys. Where is the non stocks I need four non stocks Report automatically. I need four non stocks Report fucking automatically now. Four non stocks Some of you guys don't have a job. I have a job for you. I have a season contract. Tomorrow, 12 o'clock. I need two vehicles from critics, a bike. I need it in my possession at 12 o'clock. And that's a fucking order. I didn't stutter. I didn't talk what I want to talk. Four done stocks. I want the guy in the police force to know. Tomorrow at 12 o'clock, I, doggy, y'all know the face and the name. I will be fucking seasoned guy. I need critics two vehicle and the fucking bike. And then I'm going to go back for the iMac and I'm going to pull up the fucking studio. Compliments of me. This is not a joke. I take all responsible. I take all responsible. 12 Delta 9 family, welcome back to the flight. And if this is your first time flying with us, do remember to hit that subscription button so that you can stay up to date 
with everything that's trending in Guyana and the diaspora. Now, as if things wasn't bad enough, as if Minister Brooms sweeping out critics for half a billion dollars wasn't bad enough. And allegedly, I heard that there's another lawsuit coming from Mark Benchkop on critics' head already, as if them two wasn't bad enough. Now this situation, robbing the dead of millions of dollars. This is very, very low if this allegation is real. Like, let's be real about it. How could you, knowing that a person working for you allegedly died on the job, you knowing that this person got relatives that survive in them, you get this money incoming out of your pocket and still in daytime of grief and knowing their losses. Oh, oh, buddy, you still shard them all of the money there thanks again for watching let's have a conversation about this in the comment section and i'll catch you in the next flight 100 percent wild crafted sea moss from nature by natives why pay more this cocaine that's shipping from guyana in rice cocaine shipping from guyana to belgium in rice the Belgian prosecutors got all the information. They know who the cocaine belonged to. They know who is the person who are handling the cocaine. They have the family, an entire family known as the Aquino family, who monitor, collect the cocaine, and do everything.